Well, what if you could feel better at the end of a long day simply by, flip, by flipping through a few pages of a long forgotten book? Rick Dayton says it might be as simple as picking up a photo album from your bookshelf for coffee table. Photographers will tell you they strive to make images that make you feel something. You know, obviously you're looking at a lot of the technical things and light and composition, but the story behind that photo is always, uh, you know, always going to be the most important part. Ryan Nolan is a professional photographer based in Steubenville. He knows holding an actual photograph can take you places. You deliver images to people all the time, but when, when they're your own, then it becomes really personal. So what if we started looking at photo albums to help us feel better? Automatically go back to those moments. So even on a bad day, one of the things that I love is that it brings up something that you were doing at that moment. Think about it for a second. What are the things that you take pictures of? Maybe it's beautiful flowers and places you've been. Maybe it's pictures of your family. But more often than not, it might be something that makes you happy. Kind of transported right back to that time when they snapped that image. You can do it with your phone, but Nolan says it's not the same. Just a real deep connection, and I think that's where printed photos have such a huge impact on people's lives. Two added bonuses. It won't cost you a dime, and you'll find yourself sharing your photos with people who will understand and appreciate them too. In the middle of this, all I wanted to do was reach out to those people. Um, I actually called some of those band members and said, hey, we should do a group Zoom call. People have had to connect in ways that traditionally they haven't done before, and so it's really making us reach out and look at things differently and share things differently. So go ahead, dust off a photo album, and enjoy the trip. Reporting from home and wherever my photos take me, Rick Dayton, KDKA News.